Hey loves, thank you for staying here. Um, so, live update, I, I took my ring off because um, for now I've been using a ring. I still have my ring, don't worry. No, nobody panic. So you can tell it's starting to kind of fade on the back. So I try not to get it wet so I don't end up getting like a green ring around my finger because I can tell the tip that you can see is a little bit of an indent of some greenness. You can tell it's starting to wear. I don't ever wear it in the shower with me. Um, so I just wanted to inform you I'm going to brush my hair out again because it got kind of frizzy. Um, that from the front view, um, I guess I know my hair is greasy. This is greasy and up. The rest is like me. I try to brush from the roots. Yeah, you can see my natural roots coming in. Like, you can tell where the color's faded. Um, so here's the update on my hair. Um, as you guys know, back in, like, 2019, um, in October, I cut my hair super short. Like, see my hair's down to, like, it's down to here now. Like, I can grab it now. It's past my neck. Um... When I shower and I like brush it lightly or I slip on or let it dry. Like when I let it air dry, it's whatever. But if I sleep on and let it dry after I brush it, it goes up to like here. Like above shoulder length. So this is realistically my hair length currently um, because it's brushed out. Um, the curls make it look shorter. Um, but this is technically my hair length right now. I wanted to make this video to show you guys... Um, I, I am never for sulfated products anymore, but, but, going back to my word a little bit, and the products I was using, the Heritage products, you know, I swear my life on them, okay, not really my life, but, like, I'd go use them anytime, but paying about eight bucks for a bottle that only lasts me a couple months, because my hair's just been so dry because I've damaged it so much. It only lasts like a month and a half to two months at most anymore. Um, we're going to go this way real quick. Uh, uh, it's just really loud in here because I'm right by the thing. I'll just stay in here um, because I need to show you what I'm going to start using. So basically, I've seen it on TV and I'm like, okay, is this going to work? I'm willing to put it to the test. I'm willing to give it a whole bottle's worth of use. Okay. And if it doesn't start, if I don't see any results whatsoever, because this will take me at least a month or so to get through. Maybe a few months. Uh, if I don't see any results, damage repair, length growing through, like, because my, my hands are just, you can tell they're, they're fried. And I don't want to get really my hair cut off of. I don't have to because I'm trying to grow it out for my wedding next year. My sister really, really, really wants me to have a summer wedding. I'm like, if that's going to be the case, I want to, what I want to do with my hair, if I'm going to do a summer wedding, my husband and I, like, yes, I say my husband because I am married legally, but we just haven't had the ceremony yet because we have family out of state. That really want to come at least i know i do i don't really know too much about my husband's side um i know there's that and um i have family and you know COVID's still a thing so yeah so um i'm gonna stop this video here real quick um stay tuned for part two so so the next video is becky fizzle sandy signing out